Hi there and the warmest possible welcome to today's pint-sized 10 over game. I'm Mark Nicholas and I'm absolutely delighted to bring you this special form of the game, a new form that has everybody on the edge of their seats. This is a beautiful pitch and you just had to bat first. I'm in a mountain of runs if the sun was out. The problem is the overhead conditions. It's really quite grim, a bit grey. I don't think light is quite a problem, but rain is threatened as the game goes on. On balance though, get your runs now and put pressure on the opposition. There it goes. A hopeful shout and the batsman is easily in. steered expertly into the gap. He's not a good judge of a run, is he? They've turned that into two, that's good running. He's got it into the gap. being a run there. An early wicket like that puts such pressure on the batting side. Played into the gap. Should be some runs here. Run. The sweeper picks up. They've turned that into two, that's good running. He's worked that into the gap. gets his first wicket. This was the end of the innings for Collingwood. The next batsman is Finkenstein. There it goes. Batsmen will have to reassess the field now that those fielding restrictions have been lifted. Remember, five players can be outside the room. Foreman at the start of his run-up. Yeah. Yeah. Tucked away quite comfortably.
they've turned that into two, that's good running. Batsman will have to be more careful now, having got away with that. That must be close. Mushaw is the next man in. Yes. Yes. Well, the field is not going to cut that off. away for four. Excellent shot, excellent. Such an exciting player to watch. Stroke through the covers. There's uh, just one there. That is an excellent catch. Well taken, well taken. You know, he never looked like missing it. Mohamed Akram gets his third wicket. Oh, that's a long walk back when you fail. Let's take a look at that in uh, slow motion. Low comes in at number six. It's straight to a fielder. There it goes. They've turned that into two, that's good running. That's found the gap in the field. Yes. They've turned that into two, that's good running. Well, the trouble with bowling there is that it's his favourite area, and he'll hammer you every time. Palmerson moves into double figures with those runs. Fielded by the man at long on. Murta. There's the umpire signal. No ball. Oh, 
that could be a very painful blow. Yes. Oh, well taken. Now that's an important catch. Oh, boy, is that an important catch. And didn't he do well to cling on? We can have a look at that again. Plunkett is the next batsman in. Now the bowler's giving him a hard time out there. That will have hurt. He won't want to show... Clean bowl. Well, he just got everything wrong and played all around a pretty straight ball. This was how the innings ended for Plunkett. Bruce is the new batsman. Fielded by the man at long on. Just one run. Just shoulders arms to that one. That's been given as a wide. Brees is now facing. That's racing away to the fence. We can have a look at that again. Brees waiting at the striker's end. There it goes. Shot by Lowe. A oh, great stroke. My goodness, this guy can play. What a pleasure to watch him, too. Hold him. Yeah, you know, he seemed to completely misjudge that ball and ended up just playing all around it. The next man in is Harmison. Easy catch. Lazy. That's the truth, and he'll regret it when he sees the replay. The next batsman is Lewis. It's straight to a fielder. again that is a good example of how to take a catch welcome back to the second session of what has been a most interesting contest so far the players are out in the middle, and in the commentary box is Richie Bennett. Oh, 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 that's a beauty! What a hook stroke! It's a difficult shot to play that, but he kept it down and comfortably beat the fielder. Frankenstein has changed his field slightly.
No shot played to that one. Wide ball signalled by the umpire. Harmison is going to try over the wicket. Stopped in the covers. Harmison is going to try over the wicket. Harmison has got him. They were looking for that early wicket and they're not disappointed. Harmison gets his first wicket. Butcher is the next man in. Harmison is switching to round the wicket. Harmison is switching to round the wicket. Oh, he really laid into that delivery for all the way. Shot that is beautifully played. Done him all ends up. Great bowling. Perhaps extra pace did it and it went straight through him. I mean, that's a fantastic ball. Lewis is going to try over the wicket. That's through. I don't know whether he just lost the line of the ball or something, but I mean it's gone through Ban Pad and done him easily. Lewis gets his first wicket. Brown comes in at number four. slow motion. Clark comes in at number five. Ouch, that must have hurt. That's a big appeal. We can have a look at that again. It's straight to a fielder. Lewis is going to try over the wicket. He runs here. The batsman will have to reassess the field now that those fielding restrictions have been lifted. Remember, five players can be outside the ring. Oh, big shout for that one. We can have a look at that again. Harmison is going to try over the wicket. It's straight to a fielder. Harmison is going to try over the wicket. Yes. Played into the gap. Ram Prakash waiting at the striker's end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's found the gap in the field.
o'clock facing. Thomason is switching to round the wicket. Confident appeal. We can have a look at that again. side for any bowler. The ball is just sailing over the fence. Lewis is switching to round the wicket. It's straight to a fielder. It's straight to a fielder. Hey. That takes you into double figures. And we have a change of bowling. Got him. He's gone. But he just got everything wrong and played all around a pretty straight ball. Batty is the new batsman. Plunkett is going to try over the wicket. Steered expertly into the gap. Plunkett is switching to round the wicket. Didn't get near. Totally beat him all ends up. Let's uh, see the action replay of that. Kumble comes in at number seven. Plunkett is switching to round the wicket. That has to be close. Plunkett is going to try over the wicket. about to see a change in the bowling. Benkenstein has made a change to the field. Run. Durham have made an adjustment to their field. That's out. That went straight through the gate. Brees gets his first wicket. This was how the wicket fell. Orman comes in at number eight. Brees is going to try over the wicket. Out. You know, he seemed to be 
completely misjudged that ball and ended up just playing all around it. This was the end of the innings for Orman. Murtagh is the next batsman in. Lay it away with comfort. It's uh, just one there. Brees is coming around the wicket. Yeah, yeah. There should be some runs here. Ah, oh, well, everything was in the right place there, and it raced away to the boundary. Brees is switching to round the wicket. Oh, comprehensively bold. Great bowling. Perhaps extra pace did it and it went straight through him. I mean, that's a fantastic ball. Plunkett is coming around the wicket. Plunkett is going to try over the wicket. Comfortably taken, no worries. Well taken, well taken. You know, he never looked like missing it. Oh, they've got it. That sews it up. Victory today in this limited overs fixture. On behalf of Richie Benno and myself, Mark Nicholas, we bid you a good afternoon and look forward to bringing you more cricket coverage in the very near future. Bye-bye for now.